What's going on guys, it's Kevin from Wolf Strings and today I'm going to show you how to string up a mid to mid high pocket in the Stallion 700. So this is a really easy pattern, it's pretty straightforward and if you guys use this pattern or use a variation of this pattern, let me know and tag me on Instagram, I'd love to check out how you guys string this up. So let's get right into it. So I have a 9 diamond top string here on the very first sidewall hole and what I'm going to do with my sidewall string is go through the first sidewall hole pull that all the way through and then I'm going to come through the front side of the first 10 diamond row like that and now here I'm going to loop through the second sidewall hole so that the outside of the second sidewall hole pulling that through okay I'm going to pull that nice and tight and then through the front side again of the first 10 diamond row so just like that okay and so then from here, I'm going to skip the third, and then we're going to do a knotted interlock. So through the outside of the fourth, through the front side, through the front side of the next 10 diamond. So like that. Down through the top of this little loop we created. And then from here, don't forget to pull through the inside first pulling all that slack out and then you can pull down and then that'll help form the knot like that okay we're gonna do the same knot skip a hole and do the same knot okay so skip through the outside of the next hole front side of the mesh down through the top of the loop pull the slack out from the inside and then pull down to form the knot and wiggle that back and forth so that you get um, the correct amount of tension there okay so now we're going to do one more of those so skip a hole outside of plastic front side of the mesh and then down through the top of that loop pull this through the inside and pull down to form your knot. Okay, so pretty easy, straightforward, just four knotted interlocks going down, skipping a hole every time. And then now we're going to bunch the mesh up to start forming the pocket. So here you're going to do a two. So through the front side of the mesh, pull through, through the front side of the next diamond, pull through. I like to grab the mesh here in the middle and kind of pull it into the middle bunch up that two and I'm going to go through without skipping a hole through the outside of the next hole and then pull that through underneath to form the two okay and then from here on down we're just going to do ones until we get to the last two um, sidewall holes and then we'll do a ji so we got through the front side of the mesh bunch that up do a one Another one, okay, so underneath and through the front side of the mesh, bunch that up, do a one, okay, and then one more through the front side, the next 10 diamond row, just like that, okay. And then outside of the plastic and then up through the loop okay and then here at the bottom we're gonna do the JI so outside of the plastic front side of the mesh like that I'm gonna pull that through the loop and then through the back side of the same 10 diamond row and then that tight then out through the inside of the last sidewall hole. So out through the last side. Oops. Just like that, you can tie your knot off there. So guys, this pocket makes a really nice mid-high pocket. And it's got a, let me show you the channel here. It has a pretty nice channel. Uh, not too tight, but just enough to give you quite a bit of hold 
and the whip is kind of low right now but if you were to put some heavy duty shooting strings in here it would have a little bit too much whip so what i suggest with this is just a nice clean simple nylon and a straight shooter and that will really keep the uh, whip low but have tons of hold and have that really quick release that a high pocket will give you so hey guys ball ball sit up nice and high in the pocket and i'm really liking this pattern so let me know if you try this out in your stallion and this also works with other heads that are similar like the um, nike lakota or any other version of the stallion so check it out guys let me know what you think don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll talk to you guys next time